Hello? Hello, hello? All right, beautiful. Hello. Beautiful. All right. So, this is Destiny PvP. Or this is Destiny at least. I ain't even playing shit. I'm using something stupid, uh, my Titan, new armor set and shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm cool with the late nights, few cars in the driveway, in trouble the night like how you get me sideways, you had me a drinking, slow dancing and singing, you me don't go out, but something's different this evening, could've been the drinks, could've been the bar, could have been just me thinking about you and my arms, girl. Alright. Alright, so this is my Titan. I'm running the best, one of the best shotguns in the game, the Matador 64 with a fucking threat detector, accurize, corkscrew. Even the full shield would have been a little better or something like rifled. And then uh, a fucking handling mask to work and opening shot. These two work super well together, these two work super well together, and these two work super well together. More range, more handling. This gave us a ton of fucking handling whenever somebody t goes near me, and it's a shotgun. Um, so everyone's gonna be near me when I use this thing. Opening shot is just more range. Meaning it just clocks out at 100 range on average. Then you got Fatebringer, not the best hand cannon, but it's got decent stats, it feels really good, and I like it a lot. And there's this, I was using this a second ago, 600 RPM autos feel really, really good right now. So I play 600 RPM autos for fun, pretty much. Um, I'm a Destiny 2 player, I play Destiny 2 for fun, I make sure that whenever I play, I have a decent amount of fun, but I also have, also have some really, really good stats and a ton of really good weapons. So... Pushing up forward is cauldron, so I want to be up here. One pick there. I don't know what that guy was doing. He's gonna, he's not gonna jump up. He's gonna push through here. I'm gonna back up. Let me put fastball on this. Gonna be able to really eat those fucking grenades. Oh yes, give me that. Give me that. I'm about to pull up. And then I wanna be up here. Mm, let me see if I can't push this. What the fuck is happening? Oh, that was so scary. That was so fucking scary. Oh my god, I thought I was gonna die. Okay, um, when you push up here, you jump up here. Wait, nope. Oh, luckily he was sniping there. I would have fucking been dead already. Yeah, oh. <laughs> tight and ending. All right. Um, I think there's a better 600 in this slot. And I want to find one. I want to find a really good 600 on in that slot. Because 600s feel really nice. Um, but I want something that's a little more useful than that. I wonder if I'll be able to pull, like, an old-timey one. 
So back when Red War was out, there were weapons that came with um, curated rules. So if you had like a if you had a weapon, right? That's all you need because they don't roll differently with different rolls. But nowadays they do, right? So if I go to my autos and I see Ghost Premise, Ghost Premise has a lot of really good perk, has decent perks for a PVP for a PVE weapon. Here I'll put it on. Um, and then there's Origin Story. That's a 450. Halfland is 360. Scather Locks is 600. And look, they don't really have good perks. Duty Bound does though. And that is probably what I'm gonna use here. But let's let's use them all. Let's start with Ghost Primus, because it's not gonna be the best one. The most underwhelming one first. Um, but it does look good. It looks really good. It has a great It sounds really good. I forgot about that. I hit with that. Hell yeah. I changed the color of my hit markers a while back and it's honestly the best decision I've ever made. Um, thanks to Big Umbrella for helping me figure that out. See, look, orange, and then it changes my hit marker to this look. It's mainly for colorblind people, but I'm not colorblind, so I just, whatever. Hmm, I gotta stop running off on my own. Okay. And then, let's try Duty Bound, because this one's gonna be a little better. And then, I have multiple barrel options. This is obviously the best one. Accurize and red dot, giving it more zoom. So this is the scope of a weapon called the Summoner, which I think the Summoner took this scope, but it is the same scope pretty much, like literally like they ripped it off this gun and gave it to that gun. I got one, I don't know if my teammate's gonna be able to clutch up like that. Let's take a look at what he's running. Callistos is running uh, a decent thing. He's got kill clip, he's got fucking a good Hastral. Um, not the greatest perks, but he it, it's looking pretty good. I would be definitely proud to have that Hastral adept. Um, I'm gonna pull out mine here in a second. Um, some people won't really fight, which is sad, but it happens, and I'm not as, I'm honestly not upset about him, because he's, it's not like he's not trying. Um, where's my Igneous Hammer? No, it's in the vault. See, Igneous Hammer is the best hand cannon in the game. 120 RPMs feel the best, and are the most consistent. They, in a universe where a really good hand cannon player can't use any exotic hand cannons, or or any legendary on 40s, they would use Igneous, and I'm sure they would use Igneous over it, uh, usually. So there's my Astral Adept. I have my Astral there, just chilling, waiting for me to for me to put it on. Oh my god, they're pushing hard. Okay, let me look at this three stack, because I, I, I haven't been taking them seriously. Okay, doo-doo. Doo-doo. Okay, how am I losing to this? Teabag Adept is the only good player there. And he just looks threatening. He isn't actually good. Like he has all the bones to be a really good player, but he's not as good as he thinks he is. Otherwise, he wouldn't be fighting me. Cause I ain't that good either. Oh wow, he did his headshot though. That's that's a good fucking sign. <laughs> he's playing. He's playing it definitely well. After every time I switch after this off this gun, bro, it like shit ha bad happens. Yep. Oh my god, okay. Um. Okay, so that's too bad to adapt. Oh. I don't know, I don't know. I'm trying to come up with a, with a good plan for this. But I don't really have anything. <laughs> like, I don't have any ideas or nothing. So I'm just trying to... Mm. Okay, I kind of have a plan. Kind of. I'm not going to... I'm not going to say I have a plan when I don't necessarily have one. But... So I peek this. I bug back. My shield gives me an overshield, which is super duper powerful. But I haven't been using it much. Usually I would use my oh wow actually hold on let me let me get in here. 
and then there's gonna be one down here but he's gonna jump up no if he doesn't jump up then I have advantage I had advantage no matter what though underneath and then throw that oh he wasn't pushing doors Ooh. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Shitty wall, no. <laughs> My poor teammate. Okay. Um, I think we can get it. They're, if I know these guys. They're confident. They're one up. They're gonna, yeah. They're gonna pull everything now. And then I play under here. Let me push over here. And see if I can't help my teammate over here. Yep. And then... There's still a guy over there. Um... If I want to get up there and use my super, I can. I don't know if that's the smartest decision. Nip it, I could wipe it, I could splash it, I could turn it like a motherfucker. Okay, okay, not a bad, not a bad clutch, not a bad clutch, okay? I'm, I'm sad about the trade at the end, but to be honest, he was lagging. He was completely lagging. Make him tweet like that. Okay, I'm fucking vibing over here. Oh, fuck, I don't even know the lyrics, I don't to shut up. Okay. Um, oh, shoot. <laughs> he had so many plans. Oh, my God. I think I had as many plans as a white guy in college. He doesn't even realize he's going to start a podcast and end up 30 and broke, married to a supermodel who used to be hot. Okay, I'm going on a tangent. I said fuck. Oh wow, we're winning hard right now. Um, I'm gonna. Oh wow, he's pushing. Sh he's pushing shotgun most likely, and if he's not pushing shotgun, he's not pushing at all. Some of these players in the lower lobbies are not that great. Like, right, if I wanted to play in Ascendant Lobby, this would be a much different question. I probably would have lost this with this, lost that team, against that team, if they were in Ascendant. Even if their loadouts look the exact same. The difference in ELOs are, are very, very strong. But a Platinum is like the mid, where people are kind of good, but not great. Um, they're better than gold, but they're not as good as a death yet. Yeah, they have all the potential in the world, though. I believe in every single one of them. Well, because I uh, and I went gold twice this season. I started the season in gold. I went up to a I went up to a depth, so like one game away from ascendant. Went back down to gold, and then I went back up to ascendant. Now I'm just chilling at platinum. I I like playing in the lower lobbies. I don't know if that's cringe to people, but I'm very calm and I'm very chill, and I like having fun. I wouldn't be able to rock around running fucking Monte Carlo if not. I think I dropped like like 25 that game. And, like, look at these guys. Okay, let's talk about this here. Omni Oculus Void is a really, really good build for PvP. But then you have Travelers and Igneous, which is the most underwhelming completion to a, to a strong build ever. You have um, Chris Carbine, who is honestly got a really nice Scalar and probably loves this thing to death. And then you got, he's not running Ophidians, he's got too much recovery, and I don't think he can, I think, he, yeah, he can fix that. He can totally fix that. And put that, um, what looks like into Resilience. And he doesn't, he's using this as a build instead of extra stats. You don't need a build, uh, a ability build in PvP. And this is a classic hunter, actually. This is a loadout that I would run, I'm not gonna lie. This Enigma looks really, really good, too. I love my Enigma with a passion. I think I have, like, 300 kills on that thing, which isn't a lot. But there's Messenger with 1K on it, 1.5. That is not bad. That is not a bad Messenger. And then Cloud Strike. Well, it's Cloud Strike. That's really good. And then the 
There's Macabre. That's a new age Macabre, too, which is cute. And then... Oh, he's got a new Kept Confidence. Good for him. Kept Confidence is really, really good right now. <laughs> it's like one of the best hand cannons. It feels really, really good. Mm, oh, this map. Okay. So, this map has super duper long range, and it also has a ton of close ranges up toward, toward there. So, like, if I want to get good, I play forward this way. Like, say my potential guy. He's never expecting that. Um, I'm not going to use Igneous yet. I'll use Igneous after I get my after I get this one. Yeah. Why is it always him? <laughs> like, what? Okay. Jabik just got a kill. Um, what is it? Which one is Jabik? I should have called their name at first. Oh, it's the Glaive guy. Oh, okay. So I got the Omni Lock I got two hunters. Two. I got two hunters on this one. Ooh. Mojo Jojo popped out. Okay. I see you. <laughs> I have a plan. I have a plan, which is so weird. I usually don't have plans in situations like this, but uh, let me reroll this. Reroll this. Reroll it again. There we go. Perfect. I'm honestly not stressed to put a master on this thing. Mm. Uh, okay. Let's try to spawn camp a little bit. Let's get pushing over here. Let's see if there's anyone spawning over here. And then uh, let's get let's get like kind of hasty over here. Okay, kept confidence, guy. I want to back up. I want to be up here. Yup, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Yup, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. They don't even understand the difference between a good player and a player using bad weapons. There's like, um, you know, like, they don't understand what the difference is between, like, good weapons and makes good player. Like, like, really, um, at the skill level that I'm at right now, I could use whatever I want in these lobbies. That's the difference. It's like the lobbies, right? I play in shitty lobbies. So if I pull up over here, and I make, I make it a no, oh, okay, okay, okay. I pushed one to go. I had no idea, and I was being, I was talking a little too much. I was yapping, yapping, yapping. <sighs> I might not win this one, even though I am doing pretty good, decently. I'm not, I don't know if I'm doing good, but I'm doing decently. Um. Okay, so I got a gold medal in that last round called an annihilation. It means that you kill the whole team before the next, before the first one you kill his eyes. So if I say if I kill a guy with my shotgun and I kill the next two with an assault rifle, as long as I kill those two before in the next seven seconds, I get I get an annihilation. Jesus Christ, Cloud Strike! They snipe my ass. Jabik, you might want to back up. He's pushing for a good move. Mm-hmm. Zen is really, really good on this thing. I wish I had it. Uh, I wish I had this thing. Like the Adept version. I think even the new one doesn't have um, customizable scopes like this either. Because I really like the scope on it. I don't know if it will be guaranteed to have this. Wow. Oh. Okay, I deserve that. Yes, Jabik. Oh my god, he's so good. Jabik, you need like you need to like get elevated, man. You need to we need to put you in a goddamn bowling team. 
Okay. Boom. Is he pushing? No, he's not pushing. He was pushing at the start there, though. He's above me. I want to be here. He jumped back. Oh, I'm about to fucking slide out on this kid. <laughs> I thought he wasn't going to be there, no. <laughs> I just got punked. I just got punked. Oh my god, I just got punked. Fuck. <laughs> he, he showed up when I least expected it. I swear. Okay, this is my favorite weapon in the game. Like, or favorite, like, 450 in the game. It's called the Fire Fright. It's very strong. It's got great stats for the weapon for the weapon class it's in. Like, speaking of just the weapon class it's in, it's like, it, it is, it hits harder. It's got, or it sounds better. It feels a lot better. And it's got better stats than any 450 can achieve right now. The reason why other 450s perform better is because is because the 450 autos that are in the secondary slot for so the arc solar void those ones can be used with conditional and conditional finality is the best shotgun in the game even though i can like cr like this thing is a laser even though it has ma maxed out at 100 range without its bonus perks Mm. Serving that clay code. Not even Nao. We gotta lay low, gun gun, you gotta calm down. Before I end up in jeopardy, just like the game show. Bro, see my twin, that's my bestie. So I got the blessing, I swear he's casting me up. There's no way in hell I see you passing me up. Oh my god, okay. All right, next round, we all have supers. They have two chaos reaches? I didn't even notice that. I should have looked at that a lot sooner. That's a cringe-ass fucking thing to see. I'm not going to lie. I'm fucking, I'm dying over here. Oh, bro, I'm not trying to do all that. I'm not trying to do all, oh, but I am trying to do that. Oh, 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 outside in this angle. Yep. I want in here. Ooh, nope. That was my 10k, though. I could have totally dropped, like, 14. <sighs> I'm enjoying myself, though. I can use whatever I want. So, I might use uh, Midnight Coop. You know that gun's coming back, which is beautiful. Because they're bringing a ton of really good guns. Like, they're bringing back Mountaintop, which is super-duper good. That's that's gonna be like a fun PVE weapon, a really really strong PVP weapon. Like I'm excited to see what Mountaintop brings to the game, especially if there's a coming conditional nerf, which I don't expect, but I kind of I don't know. When something's popping off for too long, Bungie tends to nerf it. So oh wow, he knew I was out of that bubble. Oh my god, what a smart Destiny player. Jesus Christ. I'm playing to your abilities, playing to your playing with your what your enemy is gonna do when you see. I mean, you see I'm running. I mean, you see I'm running away. You understand it's because you're super, and then you put you keep super on. He's a smart player. Like genuinely, he's definitely got what it takes to play like back here. He just needs a better super, better abilities, and probably better weapons. Um, most people just need better weapons, to be honest. It's very simple. Oh, he's so low, and Jabik does not have this. If I believed in Jabeek. Yeah. Oh, I gave him my best. I do want to see what the thing turns out to be. Oh, Don't make him upset. Alright, he gave it his best. Asshole. Alright. And your whole team got whooped by me. I fucking made a mess of you. Chris Carbine carried the fuck out of that. Jesus. Okay. So we're here. I'm gonna go back to the tower, see if I can get a god roll rose. 
The God Roll Rose, for a lot of people, is very different. I'm looking for Rapid Hit Eye of the Storm. Because it's super duper neutral game. That's a lot of what a lot of my weapons are, is like neutral game. Um, not paper, not my paper, not this either. These two are weird. But this duty bound, I'm gonna have to go play some PvE to go get more of this. Alright, I'm gonna save this loadout. And then I'm gonna go hop on, what build do I wanna run? I guess my... Thunderstruck build is the only one that actually has still up and running. And uh, let me go fix up some stats in there. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I put a lot of thought into this. Um, Falling Guillotine is a no, though. Mm, I'm going to go craft the rocket. I wish I could craft Apex Predator. I'm one red bar away. Fuck. Okay, let's see what Gunsmith has. He changes his shit every f at 5 o'clock, or um, a few hours after reset instead of on reset, which is weird as fuck, but it makes for interesting I interesting plays. Um, hmm. Is there anything... Okay. Just to put, like, shit out there, if you're going for these weapons and you have a ton of this, ton, ton of these, you should... 90% of the time, if you don't have the uh, the Amit or the Tapian crafted, you should be going for a God Roll Funnel Web, PvP or PvE. It's stupid good. Either way. When Volatile Rounds comes back out, it will be strong. It's just what it does. And then... I would say a God Roll Typhon. Impulse Amplifier, Spike Nades, and... Um, then whatever you want. I Disruption Break works really well. And um, Redback 5SI is pretty good too. I'm gonna go for a Jackarina because I already have all those weapons. Not just to show off, show off. This nice thing goes out, pose out. No me up, get control now. Oh, I need to go. I need to go into my postmaster before I pull like nine of those things. <sighs> okay, and then PVE next. I was really on my bullshit here. I'm not gonna lie, I was coming up with some shit. And I probably have it perfectly made, too. Um, I'm not even gonna change anything. I'm not gonna change anything. Um, what I need to do right now is I need... Um, I need to get a good... Ah, no, whatever. Um, I need to look up what Duty Bound has on it so I can make sure I, when I get it, I have a good roll of it. Are any of these good rolls? Nah, 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 ooh, nah, nah. I'm not that thirsty. Oh, this is interesting. See, these two perks work really well together, and I can respect them super well. Um, 1810 everything? Okay, um, get rid of one of these. I didn't realize my Titan was so high light. Okay. So at this point now, in my like Destiny 2 career, what the fuck is this? Okay. Get the fuck out of my face. No trash. Wait. That's interesting. Ooh. My nuts just dropped. Okay. Uh, yeah. I don't know what to do. 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 <laughs> um, mm -mm. I need better armor. I think, right, I was definitely lazy as fuck when making this build. So, yeah, I just gotta put some more effort into making it better. But I have builds for pretty much everything. Like, my strand build has two completely different stats. Okay. 
I want to do PvP, but I gotta get that duty bound, and I need to look. I need, I need to look it up before. Um, and I'm here for roses. Okay, I need to lock in because I'm fucking forgetting shit. All right, let's find something to talk about until after I look at all these things. Um, so Jake Paul is fighting. Uh, is fighting fucking Mike Tyson. Yeah, that's gonna be a weird one. Because Tyson's old as fuck for a fighter. And, like, right, he is... he He's not the man he used to be. Right? And that isn't even, like, my take. That's a take from somebody who's actually been in the... Who's been, like, done, like, MMA. And who's actually, like, been a fighter. And they, like, openly are like... Yeah, no, it's... No matter what, Jake Paul should win. Like, if everything goes the way, like human body should, then he should win, no matter what, I don't care who Mike Tyson, I don't care who you are, uh, at 40, you can't fight somebody who's fighting in their prime, you can't, it's the truth, I, I, I didn't see it before, but now I do, and let me tell you, it's just, it's like a hard realization, but the truth is that Mike Tyson is not the man he used to be, that's it, he's just not, and when he is, like, when he's done, and when he's out, and when he's all by himself, like, I'm sure he sees that. I'm sure he sees that he's not the same man. And the truth is, he is a beginner. He says that himself. That humility isn't just, it isn't just humility, it's honesty. And the honesty shows, because he's, like, he's a man. He can be honest with himself. Jesus Christ. I don't know what I ate, but I'm I'm not like like my stomach ain't feeling me. Um, I'm gonna grab some old hand cannons. Some old uh, SMGs. Like I wanna use an antiope again. Do you know how good antiope used to be? Fuck oh, the Christ. Let's take a look. First, let's go for Antiope, because that was the best. Antiope used to have... Oh, and it was 600 RPM, too. You know, now that I think about it, this gun was a lot better than we gave it credit for. And if I had a New Age Antiope, which do exist, by the way. New Age Antiopes do exist. Um, Atlanta D, what does Atlanta D have running? Oh, it's just Antiope, but it's more consistent. More consistency, more range. Um, and then... One go in here, grab a midnight coop. Oh, what's this one I want it? And this one twenty has moving target, which is not bad. I know there's a service revolver down here. Which I do like. I like I like one eighties a lot. I wish I got an old school DFA, but I just never could. Which is kinda sad. I really like DFM. I got midnight coop though. And then, let's take a look. What's over here? What's the sidearms over here? Old school allied demand? Ugh, it had fucking auto-loading? Get that shit out of my face. See, what is up with all these things being PvE-oriented? Like, this is the only PvP one, and it's not even that good. Nope, that's Grave Robber. See what I'm saying? Like, why do they give this badass, like, horrible weapons? And see, look at this. Like, head seeker, are you fucking choking on a pulse? Okay, I'm fucking using that. 18 Kelvins is also decent. Kill clip on a 300 is always going to be good. I'm going to use that. I'm using that 100%. Go ahead. Go. Go, go, go. Go ahead. Are you fancy, huh? Are you fancy, huh? Are you fancy, huh? Are you fancy, huh? Nail done, hair done, everything did. N -n Nail done, hair done, everything did. Oh. You fancy, huh? I guess I'm gonna continue playing PvP if that's what I'm if this is what I'm doing. So three weapon or uh, three new weapons here. And then if I could get a a new sidearm. Um I remember call to serve used to be extremely good. You just tap on heads and you are done. 
Let's see what else they got going on here. Ooh, Frontier Justice. What? Okay. If I had more stability, I would totally use that. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. I like this one. I'm glad I got all the weapons for that because these weapons are actually super duper interesting. I like these. And I think they did like they did a ton of them, too. So like they did one for scout rifles over here. I think they did. Oh, they did one. This is an interesting ass oxygen. Actually, this would be super duper good in PvE right now, which is kind of weird. I forgot Autumn Wind used to exist in Relentless, too. I got Relentless? I never got the old school... No, I'm gonna leave it alone. Soul Pariah. 900 RPM. Mob Justice. Mob 900 RPM. Ooh. <laughs> I could totally use that. Um, I want to make some people mad with what I use, too. I want to see. I want them to see it. Be like, what the fuck is he running? And just look at me like I'm fucking crazy. Are there any 600 RPM SMGs in the slot? Or right down here? Usually they don't make them there in here. So the reason why Shayera's was so good at for its time is because they were not there's there wasn't anything to compete with it. Hell done, air done, everything did. So old school high cal used to give ten. Okay, let's take a look at what this Red Mamba does. Because this Red Mamba is looking strange as fuck in my eyes. Yeah, wow. Perfect. 50 range, wow. And then this one... That's a lot of... Okay, let's see if I can get a stability master here. Perfect. Interesting. There are a lot of really cool weapons here. I'm like... Like, weapons that age really well. I don't even think... I don't even think I mean cool. Like, there are weapons that aged extremely well over the time, over, like, time. Um, so, right, these weapons that I'm pulling out are, like, five, six years old. And so, like, right, when I'm pulling them out, I'm pulling out, like, history. There are some people who, are, like, deadass remember their first, like, their first breakneck roll or their first Braytech Winter Wolf, right? And I'm pulling them out, like, it's nothing, not because it is nothing, but because it's, like, it's simple. They, like, weapons used to be extremely good. The fact that they aged this well is crazy. Okay, I'm going to use the ones that I have here first before I hop into some new ones. And I think this might be a better scope. Then I'm going to get a range master work on this thing. Three, okay, perfect. Um, and then... Midnight Coup. I don't think this is the best 140 in this slot. I don't think that's the best old 140 in this slot. I think there are better ones. I just don't know them. No oh, spare rations. Used to be a goat. Yeah, I used to talk about... Getting even farther south, somewhere where the summer lasted all year round. 
We got a big old diamond on your head right now. Baby, baby, you're a couple by now. Way with a big white house. And I wonder when you're drinking, do you find yourself thinking about that boy from East Tennessee? <coughs> oh, wow. With seven summers of coke and southern comfort, were we dumb or just younger? Who knows? Back then you used to love the river and sipping on a sixer. Okay, I'm gonna stop singing now. I've had my fun. I think, right? Um, I've looked through. I found gold where there shouldn't be any, which is nice. But I think there's one more thing that I want to grab. Um, in the main slot, too. Anyway. Ah. That boy from East Tennessee. Alright. We was there forever in that was seven summers of coke and southern comfort where we some were just younger, who knows? Back then you used to love the river and sipping on a sixer with me. And then I'll just use these like this. So like right if I'm gonna pull out travelers oh I should probably run like a sniper there's something long range in this second slot. So let me see if I can find something in here that's old school. Um, I won't find anything here. Let me see if there's a good scout. Um, I know these ones are usually going to be faster shooting in this second slot. What? 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 A legendary... What? 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 Why did I know this existed? Why didn't I know this existed? Why didn't I know this existed? Okay, if if you don't know the if you, if, if you don't just in case people don't know most people don't um Polaris is the stickiest is the stickiest best feeling scout rifle in the game right now on longer range maps it it dominates every everything and I honestly think that it might be stronger than ninety percent of weapons in the game right now. Or 90% of the longer range weapons. I think it's better than the 120s by far. So. <laughs> Destiny 2 was revealed seven years ago today. Okay. Polaris. The fact that they made. the Polaris pretty much. Like. I literally. Bought, like made for made. Um, I think the only problem with it is its stability. But. Stability can be fabricated. We're going to do this for now I just need I just want to use Traveler's Judgment right now because it's got Head Seeker and Head Seeker on both sidearms is really really sweet if it needs more stability then I'll give it more stability I don't give a fuck <sighs> okay I'm not going to look at the enemies I think that is what psychs people out is because they play when they think about what other people are playing they play to it instead of playing around it and when usually you just would play around it. You just believe. Whew. Okay. This is gonna be fun. Burnout. Okay. Rumble. I want sticky. You broke my heart. My thoughts are about you from the start. Oh, interesting. Oh. <laughs> 
Okay, that guy's a 1.97. I have no many. I have no idea how many kills he has this season. That usually dictates how. Okay, that guy was fucking ready. He did not want any part of my bullshit at all. No, we left. It's a five-person game. No, he's dipping. What the fuck? Okay, I'm gonna go back this way. I wish I had my actual spinning sword. This is just one gun. Yeah, I had a feeling that was gonna happen. He pulls up and he just makes me fucking hurt. <laughs> fucking why? Why would you do that? Wow, Headseeker got nerfed. I forgot about that. So a lot of the weapons that would have been good with it are now mid. With or without it. But I like the way this thing feels. I would definitely use this in comp, like, sometimes. I'm just gonna put a shield here. And then I'll see where I wanna um, push from here. Okay. See, look, there's a little, there's a little, there's a little fight going on here. And then... Oh. See, I don't think it's rude to use these weapons, but I definitely do think it's a little cheese. Oh my god, I cannot believe this is legendary. Let me see your hands to bring you outside. Ooh, see, that feels exactly like Polaris. Like, it literally is one to one. Definitely gets flinched a lot harder. I think what I'm most excited about is for this. This weapon is going to be a monster. I got flinched. That's interesting. Hmm. I'm gonna dip around here, pull up here, pull up here, pull up here. See, yeah, that flinch is wild. Okay, so some winners, some winners, and some aren't. Uh, that's okay. I have to play around my fucking range is super super hard here. Only have five kills? Okay, maybe maybe I'm like too locked in. I just don't know how many kills I have. I have a better one. No! Why is he made me I run into every time? Fuck. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna run this with a. I have a god roll, like a very perfect, like a, a near perfect god roll of. A very perfect, uh, a near perfect roll of this weapon. So I'm probably gonna be chilling for a minute. I'm in my clan chat, which is terrible to be honest. I'm, I don't know if any of the clan will be on to later and everything. I can just chill in this party. I can vibe it out. I can play the game. I can say whatever the fuck I want until people turn up. Like, I would totally run this with um, the new scout. Okay, so. Some of these weapons are not winners. Like, this Antiope. I thought it would be good, and I've definitely looked at it before like that, and I'm like, oh man, this could totally be really good, and then it, like, just does me dirty. 
Okay, it'll start me in a new one in a second. Oh my god, point A. Wow, point eight. And then I want a new playlist to listen to. Listen to that. We need stress and blooming in a glass house in the sky like the Jetsons. Nail done, hair done, everything did. Then a nail done, hair done, everything did. I want to make a mockery of people. Also, give me that. You the fucking coldest. Okay. Um. All all maps on Earth are usually long range. I think there are only two of them on Earth that aren't long range. But every single everything else is long range. You have Midtown, uh, Midtown, Bannerfall, the Fortress, Widow's Court. Um, and then there are only two Mother Earth ones, which are, um, Twilight Cheeks and, uh, what's the one? I don't even know. But it was bound to be this map. It was bound to be this map or Midtown? I know Midtown can happen. Well, Midtown has on Rumble a lot. He's right next to me. Translation theory. Oh, he bring out something old too. Oh wow, he's really used that thing. <laughs> Realizing that when your when your weapon is old, it's not better than like power creep. Really turned a lot of weapons in them. Like, made a lot of weapons unusable. Okay. I picked up Kill Clip. I have no idea how I'm going to use it, though, since everyone's going to be playing super over there. It's kind of how people work. Everything big. Hail done, nair done, everything big. Okay. I got it. I'm gonna know everything, dude. Tell them to line up. Let me see your hands. I'm pushing this area quick. <gasps> I should have died. I should have slid. I wasn't quick enough. I need to be quicker. Oh, I'm pushing up this side. Yeah, 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 oh. <laughs> Why are there so many sidearms on this long range ass map? What the fuck? Okay. I need to switch my masterworks. Uh huh, uh huh. There's actually a weapon. Um, that's curated that I can grab. It's called Vestian Dynasty. It's really, really good. It's got kill clip and it's just like, and I think it's a 360, meaning it's like just really, really fast. And so that's like one of the best um, 
the the best RPMs for your sidearms right now. I I like I like them a lot. Um, they shoot pretty fast, and it's the same with heliocentric. And if you didn't know, heliocentric is fucking amazing right now. I got 14k kills on this season. Uh, let's brag that a little bit. Tekken is not bad though. Like you can craft that thing now, and it's much better now that you can craft it. Cause I think it's got um, time dilation, and um, it's definitely got kickstart on it. I know it's definitely got kickstart on it. <laughs> that guy's so fucking. This is a dick. Oh, look, the thing, yeah, he's definitely got a good role on his translation theory. Like, he's definitely got, like, he's definitely, like, made that role. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm pushing. I'm pushing hard. Knowing most people, um, when they're, when they start a close range engagement with just a pulse rifle, or, like, just their long range, like, a uh, long range weapon, they probably either don't have a special or they're um, super overconfident. Either way, you can push them with the sidearms and SMGs really easily, especially if they're high RPM and like have super low kill times. I fucking love that theory. Uh, that, um, that, um, play style. Because it's like, it just means that I can play super duper confident, super calm. Can't believe in first place right now. Okay, I'm backing up. Boy from East Tennessee, and I know we both knew better, but we still sat forever in that was seven summers of coke and southern comfort where we longer just younger knows. I deserve that death. I'm trash. I'm making everybody switch. Yeah, wow. I don't know if that was already turning on the start, but I know for a fact that he would last time I saw him, he was running there. That's an ace of spades. Wait. Yeah, no, that's an ace of spades. It sounds kind of bellyish, but. I still know the sound of a weapon that I have 1400 kills on. Oh, and I think I didn't really have 2k on that thing now that I think about it. He's so low. What is this fucking Brazil? Holy shit! Okay, let's get the last kill with this with this sidearm, and then we'll call it a game. Fuck it. Uh, be mindful. I would never use this loadout in like a competitive match or trials. Like this is just for shits and gigs. And uh, but I do like the sidearm. I think I think the sidearm is very good. So, oh, this is 260. Wow. Okay, I have new I have new respect for it. This is gonna be better. This is gonna be better. Oh wait, no, it's not. This is more range. Everyone is giving is throwing respect my way though. I just was using I was using fucking a weapon that existed before fucking people knew that there were good that weapons could be good in PvP like always. Ooh, I'm deleting this because this is it's it's this weapon, but it's not the same. Hopefully, it's a smaller map. Two point seven five. Jesus, I didn't even feel like I was going off that hard. And I'm like not good at my on my Titan at all. Um, what do I want to display? I've got seven flawlesses, but. Like five of them came from the last three weeks, so I can't really brag it. <sighs> okay, so there's like a handful of maps that I would use hand cannons on. There's a handful of maps I would use scout this scout rifle on, rifle on, and there's a handful of maps that I would use this auto on. I gotta be paying attention to the map. <sighs> oh. What's this guy doing? 
Bro, he's playing PvP. I'll see if Thundercat wants to play. Oh, he said it's closed. I'll whisper at him. He'll be like, yo. <sighs> I'm gonna have to hear from him first, but. Look at this guy. Clammy conch? No, I don't like that shit at all. Ooh, those stats are crazy. Macho Marlin. Okay. Blunt execution rounds. I forgot these exist. But blunt execution is super duper good for a lot of different things. The Mimosa Vermilion, we already know how that works. Oh look, another one another match where we could use this scout. Even though I think I should use Perpetualis for it, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna rock the boat. Don't you miss me? Oh. Hey. Broke my heart. I had my thoughts about you from the start. My birds. I don't think I'm taking a dirt. I'm not gonna be fair. He said, This one gon' Hey. Hey. This one gon' hurt. Damn boys, like sad boys. Been ripping since his birth. Hey, I think that works. He just been said he's make a hurt. Everybody in this bitch saying now, oh, fuck my ex. Fuck my ex. Oh my! Oh, I got flinched. He's also running Saros, which is really, really good. I like Saros a lot. The fact that I've already got five kills and it's always sidearm basically means that I've been um, the way I'm playing. It's super duper lame. Like I've been playing like a, I've been playing a very lame forward game this entire fucking time. Which isn't like, it's not like a show of skill, it's not like a show of like, oh man, he's good at move me, you can use his uh, it's like, he is mainly pushing shite arm and he is not playing well. So I'm switching. Um, cause that just isn't how I want to play, that's not how I want people to see me, I'm gonna switch. You'll get fucking shredded. Clammy Conch is winning. Wow. Good for him. Good for him. Ooh, I knew that was Clammy Conch when I saw it too. He's a cool. He's a he's a cool player though. He's got um, that sidearm hit hard, and I'm sure it's either Last Dance or. Like something a little different, but not it's not gonna stray too far from the path. Let's take a look. Yep, last dance. I have four K on mine. It's the one weapon I have more than like a thousand more than two thousand kills on. I don't even know how I made it to two thousand on some of my weapons. I know I use my seven star CQC a lot. And I ran I've been running Ace of Spades casually. For a very long time. I know who's pushing up here though. And I know that he can't play me because he doesn't have weapons like that. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Okay, I'm gonna run Monte Carlo instead though. Because it's gonna be a lot more fun. Oh, 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 okay, cool, 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 cool. cool. Let's try this. Um, oh, I'm totally pushing. I don't know what you thought this was, but it's definitely what you thought, not what you thought it was. I'm gonna push. I'm gonna that. Okay, he's gonna push. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's hitting hard though. I mean, good for him. He's playing. Uh, he's playing that uh, assault rifle well. I don't want to pull out mine. Like literally, he's doing real well with it, which is a show, which makes me interested for sure.
E. Yeah, that wasn't a great game, I'm not gonna lie. But to be fair, the one guy who was actually good was running like low and like off meta stuff, so I got him. Shout out homeboy for repping the team. Cause that stuff is fun and difficult. Which I mean give credit where credit's too. He really did that shit. Baby, I need your love. Is those us? I took my burn of us. What do you got? 30 kills on this thing? I'm switching. Ooh, I wanted to switch it to the. Oh, fuck. Max, babe, it's just 10k. You see the VVs. What's my homeboy Mateo doing? No, he's probably playing. He's probably playing PvE. Yeah. I'm gonna invite the dog, the homeboy, in my right hand stunner. Oh, that night, are they out still? Oh, stunner. Oh, stunner. Beat on your head. I don't even know the lyrics to this song. Fuck. Okay. <sighs> I woke up too early. Going late nights, new cars in the driveway. Alright, I haven't loaded into a game of shit. It's been already a silence over here, okay. I hopped out of things so I could see if he wanted to play, but it looks like he don't. Um, we're gonna hop into comp, comp with this since I've got like a little feel of it. Mm, I just need a good weapon to pair it with. Mm. I'm gonna delete this Dewey Bound. It was fun, but it wasn't the greatest. Um, I have enough to switch it to. Oh no, I don't. All right. Um, I was gonna delete the Mamba and this best game because fuck it. Perfect. <laughs> what are the chances? Eat your salad, two to my duty, my foodie. I don't think I was gonna find another sidearm that this that was gonna feel this good. I remember Anonymous Autumn used to be super crazy. Damn, that it looks really good too. Wish I got one ahead of time. Last hope, this guy's ammo, not a bad. All I could afford to do was dream. Damn. I 
thinking this. I gotta show you. Um, oh, I'm playing this. Damn. Yeah, this thing feels really good. I'm like surprised. Like if they remastered this thing with like kill clip and moving target, I would totally go for it. Okay. My teammate's pushing really hard. Good shit. My team's good. I'm gonna have to start throwing games eventually. We're just not throwing games, but like switch to a character I'm not comfortable with. Switch to games the guns I'm not comfortable with and see if I can win. Because I'm gonna like I'm gonna I'm gonna get out of flat eventually, and that's not what I wanna do. Oh, wow. Now that is an impressive number. 21k on Durang. It's been out that long. It's been out that long. Wow. Crazy, because this has armor piercing and accurized, which usually isn't supposed to happen. You can't get um, you can't get bullet perks and um, accurized in the same gun. It's never it hasn't happened since these weapons came out. Um, Bungie makes a, a like a, oh, a really good distinction. Even though there is some exceptions, like um, the BXR. The BXR has both uh, has ricochet, but I think that's to make it feel better. Like. Um, just to have an extra perk, like a feel good perk. Yeah, no, get the fuck out of here. I think I only nerfed Head Seeker on, um, on Pulse Rifles. Because on, on this sidearm, I should be hitting 37, usually. I shouldn't be hitting 40s this much, but like one body shot is all I need to hit 40s. And because it's a sidearm that doesn't necessarily have... Oh wow, I got fucking folded by that drain. <sighs> but it's not as good as specifics. Yeah, it's not even crafted, wow. I haven't seen a non-crafted drain in ages. That roll's gotta be fucking something nice. Jesus Christ. He bitched us, like, straight up. <laughs> he, oh man, if he had conditional, we were fucked. Oh my god. If he had anything good there, he we would have been done for. It was over. Oh my god. Ugh, I've never had my fucking life lay in the balance there. So hard. Jesus Christ. Mm. Mm, but it's over. Wow, what the fuck? Okay. Wow. Abyss Defiant. What's he got on that thing? Classic. Not oh, Sword Logic though? I would have assumed people like Sword Logic on that thing a lot more than they like fucking Target Lock. Because it's a 360 and Target Lock doesn't really work anymore. What is up with... 
bungee nerfing perks on certain weapon on certain weapons instead of the whole perk. I miss when bungee. I miss when bungee was a lot like younger, more fucking vulnerable to more vulnerable to metas and such. Now they like have a have a handle of what they want their game to look like, and it's kind of weird because like right, they're so quick to nerf a perk on a weapon on not on not like in general like when they nerfed kill clip they nerfed it on everything but that didn't need any of it to be honest i mean kill clip is still one of the best perks in the game it's 25 percent damage bonus is even that's a little too much but then there would be no distinction between that and like golden you know, like golden golden tricorn is super duper good Oh, he's got hullabaloo when he can't kill himself with that thing. <sighs> I, had a, I had one job and I failed. Okay, so Into the Light is coming out, right? It's coming out, um, it's coming out next week. It should be next week. Um, yeah, I had a feeling that when he got in, he was gonna, he was just gonna die. He's got, he's got the one weapon that I can die by, but... I got that pick, but Jesus Christ, Brackus, you are chilling there. Two thousand and six, on his own, attention, no more fucking nickels like for bricks. In a way that I've been talking on that strap, don't make no sense. One million dollars. super um i'm just gonna replan make them tweak like them and then find the when i went away okay they're gonna come out guns blazing they have all their supers That was a 450 auto. As soon as the um, guns are blue, that was... Um, that was a horror story. I thought I got out of there. He dedicated to that kill, even for his life. Not, a sm not the smartest player, but definitely got the fucking... Definitely got the fucking will to be. Shla, I feel like I'm Gucci Mane in 2000. Are these dumbest niggas no more? 
million dollar but be posted in the fridge. Push. Okay, he's backing out. That was also pretty smart. He got the life. It's just him though. Now we're gonna hit super there. Smart play. Yeah, nothing you can do. That's all good though. I'm gonna switch to my warlock and take a small break. Ugh.